this one, I love this the colors. I love the colors this of this one. one. Can you see it? Yes, ma'am. It's oil painting. I did this. And most most of my paints is done with acrylic. It's we okay. all know it's three major paints: it's water paint, it's acrylic paint, and it's oil paint. And oil this is an oil. Oil, I, I, you know, what I'm saying, I least I do oil paint least of all of them. It takes a while to dry. Like this, it would have took two days to dry completely. Two days to but dry. The, the, but the great thing about the oil paint is that it gives the best texture of all the paints. It's beautiful. That's what makes it the the paint value. That's what makes the value the value. So my I think the best paints with oil paints is like landscape of forests. Like with a lot of texture trees and leaves. Mm -hmm. So that's what inspired me to do that. And then the green tint with the deep blue. I just I, mm -hmm. I love your combination of colors. I think they're yes, just gorgeous. I I do. But it takes a long time for oils to dry. Yes, so ma'am. It takes a while. patience going on. So, yeah. So, usually it would probably take about a day or two, you know, like uh, for me to lay one base, might let that dry, then go back and lay the next base. Yeah. yeah uh, because one of my favorite artists of all time, which his name is Bob Ross. Ah. And, uh, the you watched him on TV, from, right? I, I grew up to him. He was like a you father. Did? He did? I mean, the soothing voice, it was just... It, Sometimes I used, to, I used to fall asleep oh. on a painting that I really wanted to learn how to paint and wake up, the show be over, I'll be mad. But <laughs> that's just how soothing he was. And one thing I learned, he did a lot of oil paints. One thing I learned, you can do wet on wet. Because he's one of the... Can't he do wet great, on wet? No, no, you can't. Like, I, I want, he taught me how to do wet on wet. Wet paint on wet paint. And okay. he was the greatest at doing it. Like, did the base would be wet, but he's already laying the tree down. And, and so... But what inspired this is just the fact that with the oil color, and I wanted to just, I wanted to use oil, do the landscape, and use mm -hmm. a lot of texture, it leaves and trees. Oh, what would you call this one? Right, right here. This would be called beautiful. Uh, uh, with the wilderness, beautiful, the wilderness of beauty. beauty. The wilderness, wilderness of, of beauty. beauty. All right, we haven't it. asked you about this one. What would you call this one? If you would name it. If I, if I had to rename it, yeah, I would probably call this, you know, saying like a pe piece in the park. A piece in the park. Peace, peace in the park. Peace in the park. No. Okay. What would you call this one? New York vibes. New York vibes. I just, I'm naming it how with my soul, or what I feel when I pick it up. When you ask me, New York vibes. New York vibes. I agree with you. All right, I'm gonna turn this off again and we're gonna to get to the next one.